welcome back to my channel. Today we are talking skincare. I made a skincare video back in September updating you guys on what I've been doing, but since then I have discovered a much better routine full of active ingredients and I finally cleared my acne. It has always been a problem in my family to have acne, so I took it upon myself to clear my skin. So for a little background on me, I've had acne since about 8th grade. I am 22 years old now, so I'm definitely suffering with some adult acne at this point. But it is pretty much gone now, if I do say so myself. I had very clogged pores, I had crazy blackheads all around my nose, and just in general, the quality of my skin just was not it. And now I would like to finally announce that my skin is looking pretty good. My skin is probably like combination, I think it's more on the combination normal side since I've started this skincare routine. By the way, I did dye my hair. I don't know why I didn't like say something about that first. Um, it is now dark brown. It looks a little black on camera. It's not. It's also dirty because I, I gymmed today and I haven't washed my hair and I didn't feel like washing it for this video. So it's in a low, low ponytail. I have tried absolutely everything under the sun to clear my skin. And I found out that I was really hurting it um, during those times, like back in the back in the day. The most important thing I want you to take from this video is simple skincare and active ingredients are going to be your best friend. I will have um, a little slide right here of the progression of my skin with the dates that I took these pictures. So you can see right here, this is the progression of my skin and now I pretty much have pretty clear skin. I get the occasional breakout. I have like maybe one or, I, well one is that's on my face over here is actually a little freckle that got inflamed and now it's like a scab. I don't even know what's going on. And I have a little bump up here, but other than that I just have these two and a tiny one on my nose but before it was as you can see covered I'm gonna share with you guys my morning and my night skincare routine as well as two things that I do once a week my morning skincare routine is I don't wash my face in the morning anymore in the morning I will just rinse my face with some water a couple times kind of like rub my face with water pat it dry and then I will apply glycolic acid this is from the ordinary I'll have all of its little like information right here um, this glycolic acid is a chemical toner. It is a direct acid that you apply onto your face and it makes your face tingle a little bit, but it's basically from resurfacing your skin chemically. So it's like a, a mild, mild chemical exfoliant, but my skin can handle it. I'll apply this with a little cotton pad. I know that's bad for the environment, but we're going to live with a little cotton pad all over my face, I let that dry, and then I apply the niacinamide 10%, zinc 1%. This is basically for clearing out your pores. It has disinfectant properties. It is great for basically enlarged pores and acne. Uh, zinc is good for acne. Niacinamide is good for cleaning out the pores and making them appear smaller. So I apply this after I um, do the toner now, but before I would just do it after I rinsed my skin. So that's really nice, um, really good for acne, I love that. And then last but not least in the morning I will apply this. This is the CeraVe, I ripped off the tag to make it look cuter, uh, um, the CeraVe uh, sunscreen lotion. It is um, SPF 30 and I love the consistency of this. Um, I will do two pumps on my hand, rub it in, apply it all over my face, apply it to my ears, my neck, and the back of my hands with what's ever left over and that is just really good. You should be applying sunscreen no matter what. Um, I've noticed a big difference and also active ingredients like this glycolic toner will make your skin more sensitive to the sun. So you wanna be applying sunscreen if you are using direct acids like so. In the night time, I take a shower at night and I will cleanse my face in the shower. The cleanser that I use is the same one that I've been using for a while now. This is the Vanny Cream gentle facial cleanser for sensitive skin it is a very very clean skincare right here like it's very basic dermatologist will recommend this to you and um i'll basically wash my face with this twice i don't really wear makeup on a daily basis so i don't do any makeup removing things but right now i'm wearing makeup and tonight when i take a shower i will just do the same thing and wash my face twice with this, it gets all my makeup off. I don't use makeup wipes. I don't use my cellar water. That is literally just water. I don't do any of that. I just use this twice. I will get in the shower, wash my face, 
wash everything else that I need to wash and then before I get out of the shower again I will wash my face one more time so I'll do a double cleanse and then I will dry my face when I get out of the shower and once again it's pretty much the same thing I'll apply my glycolic acid toner my niacinamide zinc serum my CeraVe baby cream um, this is the same thing pretty much as the um, just normal like big tub of cream but this is a little bit more gentle um, because it is made for baby skin and I like this for my face I'll use the normal CeraVe moisturizing cream on the rest of my body I have a tub of it right here if you didn't notice um, but yeah this is really great I love it it's just like um, a little bit of a lighter version than the cream but you can also use just the normal cream all over your face as well once a week I will still do my face shaving thing if you guys watched my um, skincare routine from back in September I'll do the dermaplaning face shaving if you want to see how I do that I will leave a card right up on whatever side it's on I'm pretty sure it's gonna be on this side because I feel like it won't be on this side I feel like it'll be over here um, but yeah I'll leave a card to that if you want to see how I do it it's about in the middle of the video if you are interested I'll do that on usually Sundays, Sunday mornings, and I really like doing that just to physically exfoliate my skin. I will not use any scrubs like with beads in it because that is just tearing up your skin, but I will gently exfoliate with the um, little razor. I really do enjoy um, doing that as a physical exfoliator and then as a chemical exfoliant once a week. This is actually a dupe for the Drunk Elephant Baby Facial. And it's only 10 bucks. And this is the Ordinaries AHA 30% BHA 2% Peeling Solution. You basically leave this on for 10 minutes, no more than 10 minutes. It is a chemical exfoliant, so it is going to work at resurfacing your skin, regenerating cells faster, and increasing cell turnover. So it is basically just this red, goopy, gooey stuff. And I will take this and apply it on my forehead rub it in, apply it down my face, rub it in, apply it on the other side, rub it in, leave it on for 10 minutes, and then rinse it off with warm water. If I'm doing this that day, I will skip the glycolic toner because this is a direct acid. This is a, um, this is one of the, the AJs. I don't know if it's a BHA or an AHA. I think, I'm pretty sure it's a BHA though. Um, this is a, a direct acid, so you don't want to be using both of these. That will be overkill. But I will go in with my niacinamide and zinc after I use my little peeling solution. And then I will end off the night with my my baby, my baby cream. <laughs> and um, yeah, so that is pretty much my skincare routine now. Other than that, what I've been doing is making sure I'm drinking at least two liters of water a day. I find that if I drink less than that, my skin goes to shit and looks really disgusting. And um, I try to strive for three, but two is good. Be mindful of what you're putting into your body as well as putting onto your skin and you will finally get the results you need, I promise you. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope I helped you guys out with the whole acne thing. I know acne can be super, super annoying. Trust me, it's been a long time coming um, to finally clear my skin and I feel really good. And it's a really good feeling to have clear skin, I gotta say. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, if it helped you out at all. And don't forget to subscribe to see more of my videos. I make fitness, health, lifestyle videos. And, um, yeah. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!